The new 9000 series planter changes are the cast iron mainframe for the row unit. We've gone to the 16 inch double disc openers along with the 16 inch double disc openers, a double ball bearing and a cast hub for the openers. We've changed our depth control so it's easier. You don't have a screw handle. It's a, more of a walking beam so we can calibrate and get exactly the depth. For example, if it's an inch, inch and a half, it's an inch and a half. The meter unit, we extended the, the cutoff brush about a third more so the seeds can get there quicker and we've also in the metering unit we now pick the seeds up at the six o'clock position rather than the 430 position. Probably the biggest thing from a farmer's point of view is we have no greasers. On the gauge wheels we had a greaser on each gauge wheel before now we have no greasers so the maintenance is is minimal if anything. The gauge wheel assembly we've put on now with a, it holds on with the snap ring rather than a bolt and washers. To be able to adjust the, the gauge wheels now, all we need is a simple wrench, a crescent wrench if you so would desire, to loosen the bolt, turn the cam, and what that does, it moves the gauge wheel in closer or moves it out farther from the double disc openers. The redesign of the seed meter, uh, I, to put it real simply f f for a customer or anybody, we've made the best a little better. Our, our uh, cutoff brushes now, again, we've increased the length of about a third more, so it holds the seat in faster before it drops down to the, to the seat trench. Um, we've increased the area of the air to make it more uniform to hold the seeds in the cell better. This, the, the upgrades to the row unit, the cast iron frame. For example, we've had a, a steel frame before which we didn't have any issues, but again, to make the best a little better, we went to the cast iron row unit. It makes it a little heavier. For example, if a farmer goes around a corner and hits a post, for example, he won't bend, for example, the closing wheel bracket. In our depth control, if we have it set for two inches deep, let's say, for example, one gauge wheel goes over a two inch rock. It lifts one gauge wheel up, but it forces the other one down. So we'll still plant that seed an inch in the ground. It has a parallel linkage where it works in conjunction with each other. That's why our depth control is so much better basically than anybody else.